Psalm 18 I will love thee, O Lord, my strength. The Lord is my rock and my fortress and my deliverer, my God, my strength and whom I will trust, my buckler and the horn of my salvation and my high tower. I will call upon the Lord, who is worthy to be praised. So shall I be saved from mine enemies. The sorrows of death compassed me, and the floods of ungodly men made me afraid. The sorrows of hell compassed me about. The snares of death prevented me. In my distress I called upon the Lord, and cried unto my God. He heard my voice out of his temple, and my cry came before him, even into his ears. Then the earth shook and trembled. The foundations also of the hills moved and were shaken, because he was wroth. There went up a smoke out of his nostrils, and fire out of his mouth devoured. Coals were kindled by it. He bowed the heavens also, and came down, and darkness was under his feet, and he rode upon a cherub, and did fly, yea, he did fly upon the wings of the wind. He made darkness his secret place. His pavilion round about him were dark waters and thick clouds of the skies. At the brightness that was before him his thick clouds passed. Hailstones and coals of fire. The Lord also thundered in the heavens, and the highest gave his voice, hailstones and coals of fire. Yea, he sent out his arrows and scattered them, and he shot out lightnings and discomfited them. Then the channels of waters were seen, and the foundations of the world were discovered at thy rebuke, O Lord. At the blast of the breath of thy nostrils, he sent from above, he took me, he drew me out of many waters, he delivered me from my strong enemy and from them which hated me, for they were too strong for me. They prevented me in the day of my calamity, but the Lord was my stay. He brought me forth also into a large place. He delivered me, because he delighted in me. The Lord rewarded me according to my righteousness. According to the cleanness of my hands hath he recompensed me. For I have kept the ways of the Lord, and have not wickedly departed from my God. For all his judgments were before me, and I did not put away his statutes from me. I was also upright before him, and I kept myself from mine iniquity. Therefore hath the Lord recompensed me, according to my righteousness, according to the cleanness of my hands in his eyesight. With the merciful thou wilt shew thyself merciful. With an upright man thou wilt shew thyself upright. With the pure thou wilt shew thyself pure. And with the froward thou wilt shew thyself froward. For thou wilt save the afflicted people, but wilt bring down high locks. For thou wilt light my candle. The Lord my God will enlighten my darkness. For by thee I have run through a troop, and by my God have I leaped over a wall. As for God, his way is perfect, the word of the Lord is try. He is a buckler to all those that trust in him. For who is God save the Lord? Or who is a rock save our God? It is God that girdeth me with strength, and maketh my way perfect. He maketh my feet like hinds' feet, and setteth me upon my high places. He teacheth my hands to war, so that a bow of steel is broken by mine arms. Thou hast also given me the shield of thy salvation, and thy right hand hath holden me up, and thy gentleness hath made me great. Thou hast enlarged my steps under me, that my feet did not slip. I have pursued mine enemies, and overtaken them. Neither did I turn again till they were consumed. I have wounded them that they were not able to rise. 
they are fallen under my feet. For thou hast girded me with strength unto the battle. Thou hast subdued under me those that rose up against me. Thou hast also given me the necks of mine enemies, that I might destroy them that hate me. They cry, but there was none to save them, even unto the Lord. But he answered them not. Then did I beat them small as the dust before the wind. I did cast them out as the dirt in the streets. Thou hast delivered me from the strivings of the people, and thou hast made me the head of the heathen. A people whom I have not known shall serve me. As soon as they hear of me, they shall obey me. The strangers shall submit themselves unto me. The strangers shall fade away, and be afraid out of their close places. The Lord liveth, and blessed be my rock, and let the God of my salvation be exalted. It is God that avengeth me, and subdueth the people under me. He delivereth me from mine enemies. Yea, thou liftest me up above those that rise up against me. Thou hast delivered me from the violent man. Therefore will I give thanks unto thee, O Lord, among the heathen, and sing praises unto thy name. Great deliverance giveth he to his king, and showeth mercy to his anointed, to David, and to his seed for evermore. O Lord God, our strength and refuge, I come before you with a heart full of gratitude and praise. You are the uncheckable rock and fortress where we find security. I acknowledge that all my victories and achievements are the result of your powerful intervention in my life. Lord, I celebrate your justice and faithfulness, knowing that you are the author of all good gifts and the source of all strength. Heavenly Father, you have been my shield and my help in times of trouble. When the storms of life threaten to lead me astray, it is your mighty hand that sustains and guides me. I understand that every challenge overcome is a testament to your strength and goodness. Lord, strengthen my faith and give me the courage to face any adversity, fully trusting in your promise to always be by my side. O oh God, in you I find true peace and security that cannot be shaken. In moments of doubt and uncertainty, remind me of your past victories and your constant faithfulness. May I always recognize your work in my life and praise you for your justice revealed in every detail. Let my trust in you be an example of faith and hope for those around me. Lord, help me maintain a grateful and humble heart, knowing that it is your grace that enables me to achieve great things. May I never forget to thank you for your protection and guidance in all my journeys. In every victory, big or small, may I glorify your name and acknowledge that all blessings come from you. Let my life be a living testimony of your goodness and faithfulness. O oh, Father, I thank you for your constant strength and faithful presence at all times. May I always seek your help and trust in your plan for my life. In the name of Jesus Christ, my Savior, and Lord, I pray, believing that you are able to do infinitely more than all we ask or imagine. Amen.